Scanning down onto the cameras on me and I vlog. Still think that's a really weird intro, but I'm doing it. I'm just gonna keep it that way. So, hi. Um, yeah, I'm back. I, I'm doing vlogs very separately. Not, I haven't really, it's been like one a week recently. In fact, I did one oh, eight days ago. And then before that, I hadn't done one in like two weeks. So, so I am, I'm, you know, I'm not extremely active on the vlog stuff right now, but hey, I'm not done with it and I'm not gonna like just not do it. So I've, I've decided to commit myself to, you know, sort of doing vlogs. Uh, I mean, I, uh, again, I've told you before, there isn't really a specific time that uh, I'm not gonna do a daily, hourly, you know, it's not gonna be like a schedule. I mean, I could do two five minutes away from each other. I could do two two months from each other. It, it, all, it all just depends on what's going on, if I have the time to do it. And I sort of have the time to do it right now and I just haven't done it. So I thought today that I would do a vlog on this. You probably can't see it, but yeah, here we go. Now it's adjusted. Okay, so, um, I just got iTunes... Here, we'll just come back over here for a moment. I just got iTunes uh, 11 yesterday. They were like, eh, iTunes 11 is now here if you want to update it. I was like, iTunes 11? I was like, that's like a completely new one, you know, because they've just been doing like 10.1, 10.2, 10.3, that type of thing. So for the first time in uh, quite a bit of time, they're like, hey, we have a completely new version out, okay? So, um, I updated it. I think I opened it for like three seconds yesterday and just looked at it. I was like, wow, this is completely different. But I really have not looked all that far into it. So, um, you know, maybe I would just do a vlog today. Hopefully not too long of a vlog on me because I don't edit this stuff. Uh, on me just throwing it together, just, just showing you guys, uh, me trying to figure out the new iTunes because it's completely different. I mean, even in previous iTunes, uh, the big updates, even even then, like the the layout was not like completely changed. This is the first time. I mean, they have completely dramatically changed it. I mean, we're talking crazy, 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 crazy redone. And I mean, and basically, my computer is the oldest it can be in order to work with. Uh, 11, which is uh, Snow Leopard 10.6.8, uh, which is the lowest it can go. So if you have a computer older than that, do not try to download it because it will not work and you will probably lose your iTunes. So yeah, that's basically the biggest requirement is that you have Snow Leopard 10.6.8, which is really weird that my computer software has already gotten this old. Um, I've basically, it's, it's completely up to date on Snow Leopard. I am thinking about, I'm totally just rabbit trailing, but I am thinking about, um, getting, uh, Mountain Line. It's just, I haven't, uh, recently because I've been hearing it doesn't really work with our lovely Logic Pro here. This doesn't really, now I heard they fixed that problem, so I'm considering it now, but then you suddenly got, yeah, 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 you will. You will, you will see that in the RTTTA tomorrow, so just be ready. But, um, yeah, that's what that says. Um, but now what I'm afraid of is this is a really, I mean, this was like 08 when the, and the, like, they, they stopped making Express now. Like, this is the newest Final Cut Express, and Final Cut Express is now done. They're no longer doing it. Um, man, I've already been talking for a really long time. But, uh, yeah, no, basically, uh, I'm just afraid this may not work and that'll be a problem because until I can get Adobe Premiere, which I'm planning on getting in like 20 years from now, but um, <laughs> but until that happens, I don't know if I want to do this. Um, I still may. I, I really don't know. Um, Final Cut Express is really nice. I, I do really love it. It's got a lot of options, but I'd love to move on to Adobe Premiere. Um, and I have two notifications on let's see I'm so this is probably private information I am not going to show you this 
Okay, like, I care. Yeah, that just seemed to be the tab that was... Oh, wait, no, I'm going to Firefox. Oh, I'm so horrible. All right, so here we go. Here is the new iTunes. That is not very focused. That's lovely. Okay, I'm not going to take another shot. So, introducing the new iTunes. Let's click on it. Let's see. Introducing the new iTunes. Is it going to play me a video? Am I, am I going to watch a video? Am I going to play a video? The new iTunes is a completely redesigned player. New iTunes. And includes even more iCloud features. Oh my gosh. It's the simplest iTunes yet. Holy crap. Let's take a look. Holy mother of... You'll find new ways to browse your music and videos. Oh new my songs, gosh. Albums, artists, and more. Wow, well, that's sexy. That's sexy. Albums expand in place, and you can even see what's related in the store right from your iTunes library. That's Nora Jones. To switch between music, movies, and your TV shows, Nora Jones. Just this pop-up menu and choose what you want to browse. Podcast. Oh my god. Playlists are now easier to create, edit, and organize. Oh, that's beautiful. To create a new playlist. Click the add. Man, that window isn't even an complete. And give it a name. Sun. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, lovely. That's then it. That's new. To the list. So basically, now you can't really see it, but now that's how you when create finished, playlists. Just click done. That's sexy. You can also add songs at any time. Just drag an item to see your playlist. Jeez, and drop you can't it on the see any more. of this. It's totally out of focus. iTunes now includes a new feature called Up Next. With Up Next, you can easily see a list of upcoming songs. Oh. And you can edit this list of songs on the fly. Gorgeous. To remove a song, click here. Good. Oh, wow. That makes things to really song, lovely. Click this button and choose Add to Up Next. Oh. iTunes will play that song next and then continue playing your other songs automatically. Wow. I like when that. You connect your iPhone, iPad, or iPod to your computer. It will appear here. Okay, to whatever. To your device manually. Click Add to. Then drag so, it to this list. Wait. So what? Add an entire album. Oh, it's gorgeous! All the songs wow, this is a really much easier Just layout. <laughs> Just double click it to put up next here. Door has also been redesigned to make it easier to find new favorites you love. Brave. The new Ew, gross. One Direction. New, right at the top. Gross. And you can see what's popular in music, movies. <gasps> I love you. Okay. Did you recently preview music or video that you want to reconsider? To see everything you previewed in the store. It's really brand Thanksgiving. That's a. You can really cool. Any I the new i. The best i. Cool. iTunes in the cloud. Does this have to do with iCloud? What am I? When you purchase new music, apps, or books from the iTunes store, they can be downloaded automatically. Oh, uh, yeah, that's crap. I don't want to know. Okay, so, X out. So, you know, this is everything plugged in from my 180... Oh, I'm in the... I'm not even in my actual... So, can I go to my full playlist here? Can I go... Can I go to my playlist? Oh, come on. Okay, so is this, is this some new crap? Can I... Oh. <gasps> Did I find it? Did I, did I, artists. Okay, this is treated a lot more like a, like a iOS type of iTunes. This is very interesting. Okay, so this is the way I, okay, this is a, okay, alright, I got it. So, yeah, look at all these, let's see, 2,661 items, 6 days and 4 minutes and 28 seconds total. That is great. If we were to listen to this whole entire library, it would take us six days to do so. That is pretty crazy. So, um, music, movies. I don't really have all that many movies. Yeah, look, these are all the crappy movies I made back, like, in 2009, 2010 stuff. I say 2010, but, you know. That's actually a pretty funny video, but I can't really show that to you because it's got copy. Of course, what I did just show to you probably was copyrighted. I don't know. It's just a dumb tutorial. That's a good Pixar story. Anyway, Ian. Oh, yes. We all remember that. That is historic, actually. It truly is. Because, you know, that was that was basically the first official video of GC Waves uh, more than a year ago already. Gee whiz, already a year. Good grief. I still think at Mythbusters. Okay, podcasts. What, what do we have in our podcast? Okay, we've got Film Cow over here, Cat Friends. Okay, I haven't seen that. Apple Keynotes. Yep, they're probably talking about the new uh, iTunes 11. Okay, um, books. I don't have any apps. I do have some uh, home shares. All right, so uh, this has probably become a completely unattractive video by now. It's already, like, been going for 10 minutes uh, as I'm reading the time. Okay, so 
and then you click on this up here you, you again you can't really see it but library iTunes store so no longer sidebar man this is so different okay so this is what we got here Alicia Keys ACDC yes okay there is something really good is that they finally got ACDC in iTunes took forever and it made me so mad made me so mad because I wanted it so bad Ice Age blah 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 Bon Jovi yes yes man oh let's okay all right this is good this is Lord heaven thank you for your glorious music that you give me okay but seriously <laughs> um okay so this is basically this I wonder so if I search up let's just look up one of the best ever Michael Jackson yeah of course he's the top why would you why would you look up anybody else as oh oh ho wow okay this has been redone okay so albums are now right here songs are right yes this is this is highly treated like the iOS iTunes store just except on a big screen now okay yeah this is you know you got your music videos here all this sexy stuff because you know Michael Jackson was amazing apps movies got it okay so yeah they they have really changed this out uh, cha changed this around I mean this basically looks like I mean I've already said it a whole bunch of times but okay so what's this history that's great there's probably some stuff on there that I'm not gonna want people to know I listen to stuff I'm ashamed of saying you listen to One Direction? Okay, I seriously do hate One Direction, though. Like, really, Kesha. Kesha, Kesha, the one who wears really weird stuff. Glee, gross. Okay. Um, wow. Okay, so. Back. No, that's not what I... Okay, library. Hold on. There was a... Give me a moment here. What was that? What is the side... Oh! So it'll, it can bring me to a much easy, wow. Okay, this is really nice. You can hardly see any of this because like everything is unfocused. But yeah, basically. So I guess I would encourage, I really have not looked into it really far so I have not found any bugs or glitches yet. But I guess I would say to update to iTunes 11 as long as you have Snow Leopard 10.6.8 or later. Um, if you have anything earlier than that, then I'd update it before doing this. And if you won't update it, then don't update you. Yeah, even look, look at this, look at this, look at this. You're not gonna be able to see it here. Let's go to about iTunes, it'll probably bring up the icon. Okay, yeah, see that? It's a new icon. Gorgeous new icon. Whew, man, they have changed iTunes so much. Good grief. Okay, well, I have spent good grief, like 14, 15 minutes on this. So. I'm gonna go now, but yes, um, if you actually did watch through this whole thing, then just comment and like and say, well, you don't have to like if you thought this was utterly boring, but you can just comment and say, hey, I actually watched this whole entire piece of crap, and if you actually quote that, then you get a gold medal from me, a, a cyber gold medal, one that doesn't really actually exist. So yeah, um, thank you for watching me pull off horrible crummy stuff, which it, it was really dumb, but if you actually found that funny, then awesome. I guess I'm funny. It's probably not even... Alright, anyway. So, panning up until the camera's off me, and I hit the record button, and